Really happy to be here today and speak to you about uh, Hella Ventures. So I have basically three things I want to discuss. So first, of course, the introduction who we are. But then, as any good investor, we are just as strong as our portfolio. So I wanted to use this time mainly on discussing about our portfolio. And, uh, and that uh, kind of gives you the idea of what kind of companies we are looking for and, uh, and also as we see it, what we could do together to supercharge them uh, into the future even faster together. And the last thing, I will also have one deal announcement. So first, uh, Helen Ventures. So we are the investment arm of Helen, the energy company in the Nordics. So from our perspective, uh, what we are looking at is uh, building up uh, the relationship across Europe plus Israel and investing in the most transformative startups focusing on the energy sector. We are especially interested in digital technologies, so that kind of makes us special. And uh, what we are looking at is uh, companies which uh, uh, are in the seed uh, to Series B, sweet spot in Series A, and the ticket size up to, initial ticket up to 3 million. So that's more or less who we are. Um, what we do is accelerating the company. So I wanted to use the time for talking about our portfolio. So, uh, so first of all, as I said, we do truly believe that in order to uh, uh, decarbonize, decentralize, and digitize the industry, we need to focus on the capabilities, what we can build on top of the assets, the, the infra which we are generating. So obviously, we need the renewables, but the renewables as such are not sufficient. So what we need to do on top of that is to build the capabilities to optimize, to predict, to manage things, what usually used to be done by men and women, but in the future, and even today, cannot be done. So maybe one of the reference points uh, to Jürgen just a moment ago, when he was talking about Inspired, and the, the billions of data points, what is used to build the AI model. So that's the kind of the future where we are going into, and the tools, what we need to create, and go into answering the mission. Um, if you look at the, the left side, so last Eco Summit, we have Sven from uh, Life EO based here in Berlin talking about uh, the, uh, the Earth observation. So using the satellite technologies into building up uh, a capabilities to predict uh, the vegetation management and the health of trees, basically, so that you can stop them from falling on the trees, uh, trees falling onto the, the grid lines or falling into railway lines and, uh, and making sure that the people are not without electricity after the storm, for example. So, so answering these questions uh, are super important in bringing out the capabilities, what the technology can bring. And I'm, as most of us here, so true believer that the tech, uh, so, so we need to have these solutions. We need to solve the pressing issues which are there today, and the technology is a tool to do it. So for example, in this case, looking at the satellite capabilities, so the price of the satellite and the kind of satellites we are getting, so they are like the size of a shoebox these days. And that data will be uh, readily available almost real time and being able to use the AI to kind of see the trends in there and bring that to the advantage of, uh, of solving the real world problems in the industrial uh, setting. The other example of the, the AI and digital twin is our Dutch company Gradient. So Gradient's perspective, looking at the capabilities of bringing the digital twin into the district heating network. So thereby directly lowering the CO2 and of course having the bottom line savings. And then uh, looking at the other side, so e-mobility. So we strongly believe that uh, the e-mobility as such is uh, that trend of uh, decarbonizing, electrifying the transport sector, the 
the wave is already out, and there are great opportunities to build software on top of the infrastructure uh, development. And um, out of the portfolio, maybe highlighting Virta, uh, the company which is the fastest growing e-mobility platform in the entire Europe three years in a row. So it's one of the companies. And the next uh, couple of speakers in between will have Echo G, so he can explain more in detail how to really uh, speed this development up with the charging point uh, operating systems. And the deal announcement, so the, you're the first ones to know. So, so the deal we closed together with Curiosity, uh, a Dutch uh, investor uh, focusing on the AI. So jointly, we want to focus on the decarbonization of uh, building infrastructure, so real estate assets. And if you think about the combination of energy and the prop tech, it's one of those areas where we can make a biggest difference in terms of, uh, of uh, CO2 and also in terms of the market as a huge multi-billion opportunity. We all live in-house, we all work in-house, we are now in the house. So looking at this uh, capability, but not just the energy efficiency on the cost of a human. What we like most in an in, in easy case uh, is, is really looking at this capability of combining the indoor health. So indoor health for us when we are in here, so that it's comfortable for us. That's, of course, the main purpose of the building to make it for us. It's made for us. And, uh, and then also the health of the house, so that the real, real estate uh, property is safe and secured. And then combining this with the energy efficiency. So the combination of these things is what we truly believe is the right way forward in, in this field. So out of this, look at the companies. This is kind of things what kind of gets us excited. So if you're a startup working in this kind of space, come to me, happy to discuss. And if you're an investor, do come to us also. We'd love to collaborate and join forces in, in our investments. Thank you very much.